Hello and welcome to the first instalment of Moments with Mickey as sponsored by the Harbour Diggers. Uh, this is the newest uh, Manly Cricket section of videos. Uh, we're going to have some of the highest quality players as well as some interesting members of the committee uh, and a high level playing group. And today we're going to go through the cut in the pool with Jack Ritchie. Morning Mickey, yeah that's right, we're going to go through uh, the back foot shots today, the cut and the pull shot. We're going to be looking at the key teaching points as well as uh, some drills that all the youngsters at home can, uh, can, can use to, to work on their, their back foot shots. And so what are the high level teaching points that you'd be using? Look, basically I think there's three main points um, for the cut shot. First thing is you want to go back and across with your back foot. The second one, your bat coming from high to low so the ball goes along the ground. And then the third one is making sure your body weight and your momentum is going to where you're trying to hit the ball. So obviously you're around that point sort of region. Beautiful. Now Cubby is one of the best back foot players in Manly Cricket, uh, so listen in. Uh, okay, Jack, uh, we've got a pretty interesting looking setup here. Uh, do you want to explain what's going on here? So what's going on here, Mickey, this is a drill uh, involving a stationary ball and it's probably aimed towards um, young players who are sort of new to the game. Yep. Um, the way this drill works is that um, the batsman will set up his stance, he'll be moving his back foot back and across, he'll be making sure the bat comes from high to low and that his body weight and momentum is heading towards point, which is where he's trying to hit the ball. explained uh, method of how to improve your cut shot uh, with Jack Ritchie. Uh, now we're going to move on to the next section of the video and that's going to be a different shot which is the pull shot. We're going to look at the pull shot now. We're going to be um, completing a drill which is again aimed towards younger players mm -hmm. and particularly players who might be new to cricket and are a little bit um, nervous about the hard ball. Yeah. Um, for this drill all you need is um, a set of stumps. The batsman needs to have um, all his equipment and you need a tennis racket and a tennis ball and two people for the drill. All right, so now we're getting stuck into the pull shot, uh, a shot that has eluded my batting career. Uh, now, what are the key points you'd like to teach us? First thing, like all back foot shots, the, the back foot movement is back and across. The second one, bat coming from high to low, so the ball goes along the ground. And the third one is that we want to play the ball, we want to hit the ball right in front of our eyes. So there's a saying with a pull shot that you want to play it right off your nose, so you want to make sure your head is right over the ball um, to keep, your, keep the control of your shot. Yep, wonderful. All right, let's get started. So you'll see that I'm all padded up, wearing um, all my, my protective equipment. Big believer that it's important to train how you'd play. So I wear all this equipment when I play, and so that's why I wear it when I'm training in the nets as well. So three main teaching points with the pull shot. The first thing is that we want our back foot to go back and across. Second one is that our bat comes from high to low, so we hit the ball along the ground. And our third one is that we play the ball right in front of our eyes. And that means we'll be able to stay in control of the shot. There it is. Um, so the next step from here is to obviously progress to cricket ball. So um, one way to do that is to have your training partner um, underarm you the cricket ball from a distance of about five to 10 meters, where again, you'll be throwing it up around your shoulders where you'll be practicing your cut and your pull shot. Um, a really important thing um, with using cricket balls is to always keep your eye on the ball. Usually players get into trouble um, and, and possibly get hit when they take their eye off the ball. So if you always watch the ball, um, then your chance of getting hit are, are decreased dramatically. Uh, 
Uh, thanks to Jack for some insightful tips on how to play the cut and the pull. Uh, next time we have him, he's going to show me how to face a cricket ball without fear. Uh, now I understand you have started a coaching business. Yeah, that's right. So I've started a coaching business. It's called Northside Cricket Academy. You can find us on Facebook, Instagram, or on www.nsca.com.au. Beautiful. Uh, this has been the first episode of Moments with Mickey. Uh, tune in next week for some uh, more brilliant cricketers and myself.